welcome to the League of Legends Champion Spotlight, featuring Evelyn, the Widowmaker. Evelyn is a melee assassin who can dart into battles and kill single foes or go toe-to-toe -to -toe in larger fights. Able to jungle or lane as a fighter, Evelyn employs stealth and maneuverability to dismantle the competition. Evelyn's passive is Shadow Walk. As long as Evelyn has not recently dealt damage, received damage, or activated an ability, Evelyn is stealthed. While stealthed, she rapidly regenerates her mana and is undetectable unless she gets revealed by an enemy turret, vision ward, or champion. Evelyn can skirt on the edges of a champion's vision range, stalking them while undetected. Hate Spike fires out a line of damaging spikes that prefers to target Evelyn's most recently attacked foe. As her main damage tool, take Hate Spike at level 1 and max it immediately. Dark Frenzy passively grants Evelyn's stacking bonus movement speed up to a cap whenever she hits an enemy champion with one of her abilities. When activated, Dark Frenzy purges all slows from Evelyn and grants her even more bonus movement speed. Dark Frenzy's cooldown is reset whenever Evelyn kills or assists in the kill of an enemy champion. Definitely take a point in Dark Frenzy at level 4 or earlier, but max it last by level 18. Ravage strikes target enemy twice, dealing damage and granting Evelyn bonus attack speed. To further increase her damage, take a point in Ravage early and max it by level 13. Evelyn's ultimate is Agony's Embrace. Agony's Embrace hits all enemies in an area, damaging based on maximum health, and slowing for a few seconds. Evelyn also gains a shield that gets more powerful for every champion hit. When jungling as Evelyn, you'll want to start the game out aggressively, picking up either the Ancient Golem or Elder Lizard with Hate Spike and ganking immediately. Wait out of sight for Shadow Walk to kick in. Once invisible, make your way around your opponent and signal your team. Once they're ready, dive in with Dark Frenzy and use Exhaust to slow your opponent while damaging with Hate Spike. Dark Frenzy's passive lets Evelyn keep pace for first blood. Once Twitch falls, Dark Frenzy is refreshed and Evelyn makes her way out alive. When jungling as Evelyn, use Dark Frenzy to get between camps, and position yourself such that Hate Spike hits as many monsters as possible. The golems are easy to kill as Evelyn focuses the larger one while moving so that Hate Spike hits both. Once your opponents buy wards, it's important you let Shadow Walk kick in well before you get near a lane. Notice how Evelyn can walk right past the enemy sight ward undetected. Evelyn signals her team and then opens on Twitch with Dark Frenzy and Exhaust, picking up an easy kill with Ravage and Hate Spike before returning to the jungle with Dark Frenzy. While Evelyn can't always stop her foes from running, she's exceptional at chasing them. Evelyn happens across Skarner in the jungle, opening with Ravage and Hate Spike, then activating Dark Frenzy as Skarner tries to flash away. The passive movement bonus from Dark Frenzy allows Evelyn an easy kill before Skarner can reach his turret. Remember that your opponents can see you enter their jungle if Shadow Walk hasn't activated yet. Here, Evelyn runs right past a sight ward in full view due to her impatience. Though she drops her own ward to offer early warning and kills the Ancient Golem quickly, the other team is already poised to collapse on her. Soraka and Skarner arrive, pull Evelyn back with Impale, and manage to delay long enough for Orianna to close in for the kill. As long as you can get away with it, stealing monsters from your opponents or counter jungling is a great way to build an advantage over your enemy. To do this most effectively, kill the largest monster in the camp first and make sure to leave just one of the smaller monsters alive. This way, your opponents get almost no gold from them. Evelyn should focus on singling out important targets. Noticing Oriana toss the ball out from behind the trees, Evelyn turns to chase her down. Dark Frenzy and Agony's Embrace open the fight, while Hate Spike and Ravage keep Dark Frenzy's passive stacked. Because Hate Spike will ready the bonus damage from Trinity Force, constantly try to land basic attacks to kill your opponents quickly. As soon as Oriana falls, Dark Frenzy gets Evelyn back with her team, ready to start another fight. The best way to handle team fights is to find stranded enemies and come in from behind. In the aftermath of a battle, Evelyn's team is forced to run, but she waits off on the side for Shadow Walk to activate. Once she comes around behind the enemy team, she keeps Varus in range without being detected. Biding her time, she waits for Soraka and Skarner to move away as Varus retreats. 
Immediately, Evelyn opens with Ravage and Hate Spike, dealing tons of damage to Varus and taking him down. Immediately after, Dark Frenzy lets Evelyn regroup with her team, landing Agony's Embrace on Skarner and Soraka, taking them down and saving her teammate Twitch. I recommend building Evelyn with damage, toughness, and mobility in mind, and specifically as a jungler on Summoner's Rift. Consider flat attack damage marks, flat armor seals, magic resist per level glyphs, and movement speed quintessences. Try 14-16-0 masteries, getting both armor and magic penetration in offense, plus minion damage reduction, health, and movement speed in defense. For summoner spells, take Smite when jungling, Exhaust for ganks, Ignite for damage output, or Flash for safety. Open with Boots of Speed, Health Potions, and grab Prospector's Blade in Dominion or Riggle's Lantern in Classic. Take Sheen and upgraded boots as quickly as possible, then upgrade to Trinity Force. From here, you should assess the game. Wit's End, Maw of Malmordius, Randuin's Omen, and Guardian Angel will provide a mix of damage and toughness if you need the added survivability. To focus on Assassination, consider Deathfire Grasp, Infinity Edge, Bloodthirster or Sanguine Blade, and Last Whisper. Thanks for tuning in to the Evelyn Champion Spotlight. Please subscribe to the Riot Games YouTube channel above and leave us your comments just below the video.